Questions, questions, questions. These are important questions before we start. And they are as follows. Are you new to crypto? By this, I mean, are you hearing and seeing this for the first time? Or you've heard about cryptocurrencies, but still don't understand what is crypto? If that's the case, please stick around. I have some important information that I will share with you today absolutely free. And do you know or have you heard about cryptocurrencies before? If you know, who has told you and how long have you known about cryptocurrencies? Or if you've just heard about cryptocurrencies before, was it from a friend, a colleague, or even a stranger? Are you afraid of cryptocurrencies? Is it because you are afraid of adapting to new change, to, to change, afraid of new things? Or are you afraid because you were told that Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies, they are evil and that's uh, what is available in the cryptocurrency space is only scammers and fraudsters. Well, with an exception of uh, crypto being evil, I would like to agree that there are scams, there are fraudsters in the crypto space, but they are also good investors in the crypto space and there are also genuine people in the crypto space. There's always two sides of the story. So please don't listen to someone who will only tell you one side of the story. Find the other side of the story, which is the positive side of it, and see if it can benefit you or not. Have you made any investment in crypto and lost it all? Meaning that did you buy a coin that you were not supposed to buy and you actually lost your money or the coin that you bought uh, went down uh, the price by the price and you thought that you have lost it all and you are not going to make any money in crypto and you took your money and converted your crypto into paper money? Or have you made any investment in crypto and made profits? If that's the case, when was this and how did you make profits? How much was it? How did you time the market? How did you know which coins to buy and which ones you shouldn't buy? And have you been scammed before in crypto? Was it by a friend? Or was it by someone that you met on Facebook that was using the name of Luno to scam you and you lost your money? If that happened to you, I am deeply sorry. And I would like to tell you that Luno is a reliable platform. I've used it and I'm still using it today. I've never had any problems with it. If you would like to have an account with them, just simply download an application and register and follow the instructions from Luno. Having said that, tell me, are you thinking about investing in cryptocurrencies, but you don't know where to start? As we have seen and mentioned that there are scams and fraudsters in this space, you must be careful if you enter this cryptocurrency space. And I would actually like to recommend that you find yourself a mentor, which is my mentor. And I will tell you why, and you will actually find out as I read along as to why I chose James as my mentor. I'm going to read word for word on what James has to say, and then you will understand why I chose him. Well, who am I and why would anyone want to copy me? Hi, I'm James McMahon and I run the Crypto with James YouTube channel, which has over 40,000 subscribers. As of October 2023, I've made 1,029 videos with the aim to help regular people retire early by knowing which coins to best profit from. I take immense pride in not missing my words and having and have recommended 26 coins for my viewers to invest in. Had you invested 100 US dollar into each coin, you would have made 123,795 US dollar in profit. See below for proof with exact numbers and dates, all which you can verify on YouTube. Here's breakdowns of every coin I've recommended with the price when I first spoke about each, along with its price as of 1st October 2023, and what it reached at its peak. Prices as of 1st October 2023. Coin, Phantom, price at recording, fractions of, the, of a penny. Current price was 45 cents. Had you invested 100 US dollar on 
Phantom, you would have made 8,800 US dollars in profit. Tether is another coin. Price at recording was 31 cents. The current price was $1.08. Had you invested 100 US dollar in Tether, you would have made $241.87. Another coin is Zilliqa. Price at recording was fractions of a penny. The current price was $0.02. Was two cents. Had you invested 100 US dollar in Zilliqa, you would have made 585 US dollars and 81 cents. These are some of the coins that are on James' portfolio. We can see that there's two coins that did not perform well, which is Dragon Chain as well as Nano. But most of the coins, they did very, very well as of the 1st of October, 2023. Let us read more from James. Notice my top coin Phantom has gone up almost 700 times in value. This was not luck because on 2nd June 2020, I singled out Phantom as the best cryptocurrency of the year when it was just half a cent per coin. On 28th October 2021, Phantom hit $3.46 per coin, 692 times more than when I first said. It was an incredibly risky prediction for me to make because had Phantom done badly or been outperformed by any other coin, I would have looked like an idiot. On Thursday, 28th October 2021, Phantom peaked at $3.46 a coin, 692 times its, value, its original value. Grab those calculators. Because had you invested $100, US it would now be worth $69,200. One thousand US dollar would be six hundred and ninety-two thousand US dollar, and ten thousand US dollar would be six point ninety-two million US dollar. Video proof of the Phantom prediction recorded in March twenty twenty-one when Phantom hit only eighty-four cents. Let's read more from James. On thirteenth August twenty twenty. I told everyone to sell YAM at $131 per coin because I hated everything about it. The next day, it crashed to just $0.78 cents per coin. In August 2020, YAM was amongst the hottest coins in crypto. Everyone and their mother was buying and its price hit $131 per coin. On 13th August 2020, I took the unpopular opinion and released a video telling everyone to pull out their profits and sell that crap immediately. The next day, Yam crashed to 78 cents and became one of the biggest destroyers of crypto wealth in recent history. It's all good and well making good crypto investments, but one bad one can lose you everything. And if your crypto expert can only spot winners and not the hype backed losers, then don't expect to stay rich for long. Having said that, I would like to officially introduce myself. My name is Cash Money Master, and I would like to welcome you to this amazing platform of mine where I talk about cryptocurrencies. But before I do, I would like to talk about the difference between fiat and crypto. Well, fiat currency is centralized issued and controlled by third parties, while cryptocurrency is decentralized. Transactions are peer-to-peer. -peer. Cryptocurrencies exist in limited quantities, while fiat currencies can be issued at will. Bitcoin, for example, is limited to 21 million units. Now let us take it a step further and compare these two, these two currencies. Fiat is physical. Simply means it is paper money that you can hold, you can feel it, you can touch it, and you can see it with your eyes. But crypto is a digital currency. You cannot hold it, you cannot touch it, you cannot feel it, but you can actually see it on your digital currency wallet. If you have one, you can see the balance, you can actually send or receive cryptocurrencies if you have a digital currency wallet. Fiat is issued by government. The government prints and brings this currency to the market so that you and I, the consumers, can use it to buy goods and services. 
but crypto is generated by computers. These computers are called mining rigs. They are they use high computing power to solve complex math problems. In so doing, they produce cryptocurrencies. Fiat is centralized, monitored by the government. So the government monitors the currency that is used within its country. Crypto is decentralized. No one can control it. It means that anyone who has a smart device all across the world connected to the internet can actually send and receive cryptocurrencies if they have data and active cryptocurrency wallets. Fiat has unlimited supply. This simply means the government can print paper money as it so wishes without a limit. And we know what happens when paper money is printed without a limit. We, the consumers, get affected by inflation and we lose buying power. But crypto has limited supply. As we have seen in the previous page that Bitcoin is limited to 21 million units. Even other cryptocurrencies, they have their own limited supply. And we know that where there's limited supply and high demand, the price tends to go up. And when the price goes up and you have invested and have taken your profits in crypto, it means that you have buying power. Fiat is restricted by borders with an exception of a dollar. It simply means that each and every country has its own fiat currency that works within the borders of that country. But crypto is unseizable. This means that anyone who has a cell phone, a laptop, a tablet, even a personal computer connected to the internet with data and has a cryptocurrency wallet, they can actually send or receive cryptocurrencies. Now, having compared the two currencies, I'm sure you can tell which one is better than the other and which one you can actually make money from. But me, Mr. Cash Money Master, I have obviously chosen the one that I am talking about because it is obvious I'm talking about cryptocurrencies. Now we have mentioned Bitcoin as an example of a cryptocurrency because it came first in the crypto space as a successful cryptocurrency. Let us get the real meaning behind Bitcoin. Bitcoin is a cryptocurrency, a visual currency designed to act as money and a form of payment outside the control of any one person, group or entity, thus removing the need for third party involvement in financial transactions. It is rewarded to block, to block chain miners for verifying transactions and can be purchased on several exchanges. Now, to find out what is Bitcoin in full details, you actually need to get yourself a document called the Bitcoin White Paper. It is available on any browser. You can just simply type the Bitcoin White Paper. I would recommend that you click on bitpanda.com to get the Bitcoin White Paper because it explains it in the simplest way ever. It's a nine pages long. It explains everything that you need to know about Bitcoin and it will answer all the, the questions that you've been having about Bitcoin. Now, Bitcoin is a volatile currency because it has done very, very well and it has done very, very bad. Let's find out what does this really mean. On number two. Volatile simply means that it is liable to change rapidly and unpredictable, especially for the worse. It simply means that the price of Bitcoin can go up and it can go down within seconds, within minutes. It is unpredictable, it could go down for the worse or it can even go up for the better. Now, after Bitcoin, there came other cryptocurrencies in the crypto space and they are also affected by this volatile market. Now let's have a look at these cryptocurrencies that are affected by this volatile market. To find out, you can just simply type crypto and then type bubbles on your browser, then click on cryptobubbles.net. You'll take into this page, which is similar to mine. 
The coins that are in green circle are coins that are performing well. This shows that the market is happy, the market is healthy today. Most coins are performing well. To those that have invested in those coins and they are taking profits, they are smiling today. Now, I would like to mention a few of these coins that are performing very well today, which is RLB. It is up by 11.1%. We have BSV, which is up by 11.1%. We have RNDR, which is up by 6.9%. Now, have a look at some of the coins that are not doing well today. We have RPL, which is down by 1.7%. And we also have XMR, which is also down by 1.2%. Now, these are the coins that are in the market and how well or bad they are doing today. Now, let us look at the factors that affect these cryptocurrencies in a negative or rather positive way. To find out, you can just simply go to your browser and type coin market and then type headlines and click on where it says headlines coin market cap. You will be taken to this page where it says news insights into the biggest events shaping the crypto industry. Waves circle around MKR. Could the altcoins price search soon? To get details, you can go to Coin Edition. Then we have increasing number of ApeCoin and Pepe holders are buying the Nugget Rush presale. Here's why. You can get full details on Coinpedia FinTech News. Now we also have TRX price analysis. Steadfast buyers eyes 10, 10 cents this October. You can get this on Coin. Fintech news. Now let us have a look at what we call the market cycles. Now, if you consider investing in cryptocurrencies, this is the basic information that you need to know. It's very important. Anything else can come after. Because if you don't know and understand the cryptocurrency market cycles, you are not going to make money. You are going to lose money. Here's why. Examples of market cycles in cryptocurrency. 2022 bear market. The bear market was last year. This is when the prices of cryptocurrencies were not performing well. The prices had depreciated. They were in a negative by 40, 60, some even 80 or 90%. Then, the 2023 accumulation, it is this year. This is the year where cryptocurrency investors buy cryptocurrencies. They are adding more into their portfolios. 20 more, 10 more, 5 more. It depends on the appetite of an investor. Then we have 2024, which is the Bitcoin halving cycle. Bitcoin halving cycle, this is when the coins, which is the Bitcoins, that are mined are being cut into half to counteract inflation and to maintain scarcity. Then we have 2025, which is the bull run. The bull run is the time when prices of cryptocurrencies appreciate, they go up, they are in the positive, they are doing well. Crypto investors who have been in the crypto space and they have benefited from the previous cycle, Chances are they might do so in 2025. And if they withdraw their profits in time, there's a high possibility, just like it, ha it has happened with other cryptocurrency investors who have done well, have become millionaires and others have become billionaires. Yes, it is true. You can verify this information. It is true. There are crypto investors who have made millions and there are some who have made billions those who have taken their profits in time and have invested in the right coins those are the ones that i'm talking about now i've mentioned bitcoin halving cycle let us find out what's the real meaning behind bitcoin halving well bitcoin halving is when the reward for bitcoin mining is cut in half halving takes place every four years 
the halving policy was written into Bitcoin's mining algorithm to counteract inflation by maintaining scarcity. Now that's the true meaning behind Bitcoin mining. Now, as we have seen in the previous page, the market cycle, now you have an idea on how to position yourself should you consider investing in cryptocurrencies. But make sure that you don't buy one cryptocurrency should you consider investing in cryptocurrencies in case that coin doesn't do well then you can actually benefit from other coins. Now, having said that, I would like to present to you how to build a long-term cryptocurrency portfolio brought to us by Forex.Academy. To find this information, just simply type the importance of having a cryptocurrency portfolio. Click on images, scroll down until you come across this image with a heading, how to build a long-term cryptocurrency portfolio. Click on it, you'll be taken to this page. Now let's have a look at an example of a cryptocurrency portfolio. The code is BTC, amount is two. The BTC value is one. The USD value is $1,756.01. The wallet value is $3,512.02. The exchange is Polynix. The percentage of holdings is 56.19%. Another coin is XRM, code. The amount is 20, the BTC value is 1 cent, the USD value is $29.96, the wallet value is $599.15, the exchange is Polynix, the percentage of holdings is 9.59%. Now let's have a look at one coin at the bottom, which is the code is Dodge, the amount is 10, BTC value is fractions of a penny, the USD value is zero, the wallet value is set with one cent, the exchange is Polynix, the percentage of holdings is zero. Now let us read this information to understand how to build a cryptocurrency portfolio. Historical data shows that the crypto market has returned over 900% since 2017. Of course, the journey hasn't been all smooth as evident from the often unprecedented deep and high trends of the market. But in the long haul, its valuation has been increasing as more investors join the trade. With this in mind, the idea of targeting long-term gains is more appealing than chasing short-term profits, which are often not as much as the former. Now let us continue reading. While investing in the long term promises greater returns, it should be noted that the method requires patience and keeping your emotions under check or in all market types. To achieve this, you should only invest an amount that you can live without. So no matter what happens, you won't have the edge to sell your cryptos to sustain yourself. Also, having a cushion to fall back on will prevent you from panic selling. Now, why should you consider long-term crypto investment? Foregoing the short-term profits in favor of long-term gains is not only highly rewarding, but also less risky. As such, you don't have to worry about missing out on leveraging into a position or timing the market. Day trading or rather short-term investment is characterized by numerous transactions whose fees can quickly accumulate and eat into your profits. But when investing in the long term, all you have to do is pick a few cryptocurrencies and then wait. This helps reduce the number of transactions, saving you the fees that come with active trading. Now we go ahead and read about indicators of long term value. Building a long term portfolio boils down to the type of digital currencies you invest in. With over a thousand cryptocurrencies in the market, it can be overwhelming to choose one that pays off in the long run. Here are a few factors to consider when choosing cryptocurrencies for your long-term portfolio. I will read here, it says the market cap, utility value, the industry, don't be too rigid. And the conclusion reads as follows, while the above, Tips will help you build a long term portfolio. You should note that the crypto market is highly volatile. To keep up with the trends, it demands that you regularly track and rebalance your portfolio in line with your objectives. 
Also, it's a good idea to keep tabs on market events such as government laws in your jurisdiction regarding cryptocurrencies. These events usually have an impact on price movement. Now, if you would like to read about the, the market, the utility value, as well as the industry, you can pause the video and read full details at your own time. Now, having said that, I would like us to proceed with my mentor because if you are going to invest in cryptocurrencies, you need someone who is well informed. Now, let us see as to what you are going to get should you consider being a member of Copy My Crypto. You will have 24 7 access to James' personal portfolio. When you join, you will gain instant access to the membership portal where you'll find a video with his portfolio. This isn't a theoretical portfolio. These are the exact coins that he holds to build his personal wealth. Just decide how much you want to invest and you can split it into the same coins into the percentages he tells you. You'll be shown step by step how to do this, but here's an example to help you understand. Let's say his portfolio is split 50% in Cardano, 30% in Ethereum, and 20% in Polkadot. And let's say you decide to invest 5,000 US dollar. Here's how much you would invest into each coin to copy him. Cardano, 2,500 US dollar. Ethereum, 1,500 US dollar. Polkadot, 1,000 US dollar. Now let us get more from James. You will also get an email the moment he decides to buy or sell coins. As the market changes, so do the best coins to hold. Which means he will sell or reduce the amount invested in one coin for another. Before he does, he will send an email 48 hours in advance so you too can get in at the same time, at the same price he does. This is essential to making maximum profit. Don't think you need to be glued to your inbox and act, and act within minutes of his email. That's not how the market works. He will give you a thorough explanation behind every decision that he makes, but it makes no difference if you understand it or not. He will do all the legwork. Now let us see what, uh, what some of the members of Copy My Crypto have to say about James. Here's what one long time viewer has to say about James on the brink of retirement at 34. James is the only crypto expert who is clear on which coins to buy and avoid. The others don't do this. They review every coin under the sun, but that just confuses me as I don't know how to pick one coin over another, which is all I care about. I thank the universe I found James' channel when I did as his advice has put me on the brink of a very early retirement. Another one that we have right here is Jack Sanders, age 32, from Maine, the United States of America. He turned 21,500 into 725,266 US dollar over 10 months. My crypto profits, this is what he has here to say. My crypto profits invested 21,500 US dollar, now worth $745,266. Thank you, James. So we can realize that James or his team made a, an error by typing 725,266 instead of 745,266. Now let us go ahead and have a look at another one which is Art Wagner, age 38, from Bristol, UK. He turned $3,100 into $57,133 in eight months. He, this is what he had to say. My crypto profits invested $3,100, now worth $57,133 US dollars. Thank you, James. Now, as we have seen that Phantom has done really, really well. I'm sure you're wondering if there will be an opportunity like that. Now, let us find out what James has to say about that. The good news is there will be coins which perform as good and better than Phantom. 
I hope that answers your question. And should you choose to copy his investment strategy, you too will reap the same profits he does. Listen, anyone can strike lucky and hit a winner from time to time, but only the really knowledgeable investors are able to look at the coin and pick out a loser. And he has done exactly that. Now I'm sure you are scratching your head and wondering, now that you have uh, all this information and seen these testimonials, you want to start, but you don't know what to do from now going forward. Well, what if you've never invested a day in your life and have no clue how to invest in crypto? This is the answer for you coming from James. No problem. Inside the members area, he's saying that I have an A to Z step-by-step -step video course to show you what I do. These are the same instructions I have talked through with friends and family. Many who knew nothing about crypto or how to invest in anything. The course is called the Complete Beginner's Tutorial to Crypto Investing. And it's yours for free when you join. Now, that's what my mentor has to say and offer to you. Now, having said that, I would like to thank you so, so much for tuning into this amazing space of mine where I talk about cryptocurrencies. Now that you have seen what my mentor has to offer in my presentation, and you would like to join me and be a member of Copy My Crypto as soon as possible, not a problem. I have a, a link in the description of this video. You'll find it at the bottom. You can just simply copy the link, paste it on your browser, and then you'll be taken to James' site and find out what he has to offer and who is James, the testimonials and all that you need to know. And if you like it so, so much, then you can join us and be a member of Copy My Crypto. I will also include a link on how you can register your own Binance account and get verified. I'll also include a link on how to fund your Binance account using your bank account. Please make sure that you click the, the notification. You click, uh, you subscribe to the channel first. You click the notification bell to get uh, updates on what is to come in terms of my videos. Please share this video with your friends, colleagues, family members so that they can get the same value that you are getting. And please click the like button to show that, yes, you're saying thumbs up to what I have shared with you and you like it. Having said that, I would like to thank you so, so much. And I will be seeing you in the next video.